Hi, John and Jack and everyone with John Beauville Law Offices. My name is Christian Renna. I'm with RinGen SEO, local digital marketing agency. Just wanted to shoot this quick video for you, give you guys some free tips and tricks on how you can increase your online presence on your own. Contrary to popular belief, uh, your website can actually bring you leads in and of itself without paying outside lead generation services. So, uh, and the leads that come through your website are going to be exclusive to you, um, and they're not going to be sent out to three or four different attorneys. And so, uh, three things we're going to talk about today, content citations and backlinks, the first being content. Um, Google loves content. The more content you have, the more relevant you appear and the more visible your website is to the public uh, to bring that valuable content. And so content isn't just the words on your website. It's also the photos on your website. It's also what's behind the photos and how the photos are saved and alt tags and meta descriptions and site titles, so on and so forth. And so this is your main page. I went through, um, I did not see uh, 1500 words nowhere near. Uh, which is fine because it's your main page. But then the thing is, really, when we get into the guts of the website, that's where we want this words. And so I'm not sure which one of these, whether it's family law, prenuptial agreements, child custody and visitation, powers of attorney. I'm not sure which one of these um, you focus on most or if it's all of them equally. But um, I'll just go to the divorce and division of assets because it seems to be a, a common reoccurrence these days. Um, and this is, um, so we're not near that mark. So Again, I didn't put this through word counter, but um, maybe five or six hundred words total. So you're going to want to pump that number up um, if this is an important page to you, if you want to be relevant in that page. Uh, if we go to powers of attorney, okay, uh, right around the same, maybe five, six hundred words. So you're going to want to make sure that all these pages have 1500 words, and then you're going to want to make sure that all these photos are saved the right way. So a lot of times, uh, when we upload photos, the computer creates a name for the photo that we don't create for it. Um, and you're going to want to delete that and make sure that you use the proper content um, for every photo because Google does read how those photos are saved. Um, moving forward, the next thing we're going to talk about is citations. So what a citation is, is anywhere on the web that your business name, address, and phone number is listed in various directories. Um, that would include Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, Better Business Bureau, Yellow Pages, Yelp. Uh, and so I typed in Attorney Saginaw, Michigan. Uh, we got Lefevre, we got Sturtz, and we got Melton. Okay, you're not here. This is where you want to be. You want to be in the top three here um, on this map pack. <clears throat> These are the guys bringing in the majority of the dough. Um, and then, and then, if not, you at least want to be on this main page here. Uh, I do see a Smith Bowville. I'm not sure if that's you. Um, or not because um, you're John Beauville, but Smith Beauville is here. So either way, on the fourth page. Um, and then I believe how we found you was um, you were paying for an ad for lawyers uh, in Saginaw. And so your name popped up here. Um, so you were paying for an ad um, for lawyers Saginaw. Um, but as, as you notice, these guys actually are not paying for anything. Uh, it's just their citation. So if you look, um, uh, Briz Boyce, these guys actually weren't under Saginaw, Michigan attorneys. Um, Melton was, but they are here. And then obviously Lefevre and Sturtz, they're on both. So they're doing the right things. But this has to do with citations. Um, so the more you have, the better. And then um, next, I have your Google My Business page pulled up. Uh, and so a couple of things I want to point out. Um, you do have 25 reviews. So that is the number we recommend, 25 minimum. Uh, you do have your address, your hours, your phone, and your website in the appointments, so that's good too. Uh, the only other thing I'd like to point out is these photos. So it looks like you guys have one, two, three photos. Um, you want 10. So you're going to want to have 10 photos um, minimum, and then again, you're going to want to make sure that you save those photos the right way. Uh, and that'll help your Google My Business page out dramatically. So um, the last thing we're going to talk about today is backlinks. Um, what a backlink is, is anywhere that your URL, so anywhere that johnbeauville.com is at, uh, is going to give you a backlink. And so you guys actually have 47 backlinks from 15 referring domains. But if you look here, your domain rating is a 0.2. Uh, that's a 0.2 out of 100. And so the thing to remember with backlinks is that they're not all created equal and you want to make sure that all your backlinks come from relevant sites that aren't spammy. Um, 
these obviously are not bringing you much value uh, as well as not bringing you much power. So I would highly recommend removing the backlinks that aren't bringing you value and then finding yourself some good ones that uh, bring you massive value. Uh, this is um, certain certain backlinks are free, certain backlinks you pay for, but if you do your homework, this will bring significant power to your website um, and your domain. Uh, this is a tool we use called AREFs. <clears throat> Feel free to use this one if you'd like. Uh, other than that, I hope this video finds you well. I hope that you find the time to implement uh, these tips and tricks into your website uh, to bring you more lead volume on your own. Uh, and so if you have any questions, comments, or feedback, do feel free to get in touch with us. Uh, and other than that, thank you very much for watching.